Hi everyone, I'm Josh, and today we'll discuss Wondershare Presentery, a tool that adds life to your slides. Have you ever wondered how to bring your PowerPoint to the next level by recording yourself presenting it? That's exactly what we're covering today, with a special focus on the camera recording feature of Wondershare Presentery. If you want more tips and guides, please subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell to stay updated. So, let's begin. Sometimes the traditional slide-based presentations do not meet the needs. But if you turn your presentations into a video, you can better explain it to the viewers. With your expressions and body language, you can connect with your audience in a more engaging way, don't you think? This approach not only enhances the viewer's understanding, but also turns a standard presentation into an interactive experience. But most presentation makers don't have this feature. So how do you record yourself while presenting a PowerPoint? That's where Wondershare Presentery comes into play. Let's see how you can record yourself presenting a PowerPoint with Wondershare Presentery. First things first, you'll need to download the software from the official website. You can use the link in the description below to download and install it right now. Don't worry, I've already installed it on my computer, so we can jump right in. Once you've launched Wondershare Presentery, select Video Presentation Mode. Now, click here to import your local presentation file in Wondershare Presentery. And here we go, a new project has been created with your PowerPoint presentation. Now, let's set the stage. You can use the Import function on the top bar to bring in any material if you want to add it to your slides. Just find your your file and wait until it's opened up here. You can also adjust the PowerPoint presentation and change its size. If you want to add some eye-catching background to your presentation, click here on the resource section and apply any background you like. Ta-da! Now let's just adjust our presentation according to this background. Perfect. Now, before we hit record, let's ensure our camera and microphone settings are just right. If you are already seeing this camera overlay, then it's good. Just drag it where we want it on the slide and adjust its size. But if the camera overlay is not showing, check the settings. You'll find these options in the bottom left corner here. Here, you can pick the right microphone and camera and even select the system audio if you want. If you need help remembering what to say, you can use the teleprompter feature on the top bar. Just click here and import a text file to keep you on track. All right, let's take a quick preview. Click on this preview button on the bottom toolbar. You can also hide the camera during recording or make it full screen from these options here. So everything looks good, great. Now go back to the editor. You can start recording by hitting the recording button or pressing the hotkey F9. There's a three second timer and then we'll be off and running. If you need to pause or resume during recording, just use the toolbar or press F9 again. And to stop, simply press this red button or press F10 on your keyboard. Once finished, you can make some basic edits like adjusting the volume or trimming your video. Then all you have to do is export the file. Click on this export button and select a name for your recorded video. You can also change the directory where it will be saved on your computer. Then export. Now you've got a beautiful video of yourself presenting a PowerPoint. Click here to open the folder where it's saved. As you've seen today, recording yourself presenting a PowerPoint has never been easier with Wondershare Presentery. From importing your PowerPoint file to exporting the final video, we showed you how to record yourself while presenting in a stepwise manner. So why are you still waiting? Click on the link below to explore Wondershare Presentery and start making your own dynamic presentations. I want to extend a big thank you to everyone who tuned in today. If you have any questions, please feel free to leave a comment. Until next time, take care.